Sick. Hello everyone, I hope you are having a wonderful day. My name is Rikana Sayano and welcome back to Celeste. On this episode, we are not doing the summit. We are in fact doing... What is this called? Reflections. Um... I've never, I didn't practice this chapter, so uh, that's definitely a thing. So in the last episode, we uh, got out of Mirror Temple, and on this episode, we're going to have a fire and have a nice, civil conversation with our boy, Theo. Theo, you're awake! Am I? I'm skeptical. I had a messed up nightmare. Yeah, okay. About that. Wait. Oh, yep, it's definitely coming back to me now. That actually happened. Thanks for getting us out of there. I'm glad we were in it together. I don't know if I could have done that alone. Uh, let's do this one. How long was I out? Oh, uh oh, Theo's asking. Ooh, my bad. How long was I out for? It must have been a few hours. Man, what a ride. Tell me about it. Are you okay? I mean, aside from the existential crisis? Yeah, I'm fine. Clearly, this isn't a normal mountain. What's really going on here? I should have told you sooner. Back at the old ruins, a part of me escaped from the mirror. A part I'm not proud of. I swear I dreamt it. You think the mountain made her real? Yeah. She's been haunting me the whole time. She lashed out at Mr. Oshiro. I think she was the reason the gondola stalled out. And she was there, in the temple. Why didn't you say anything? I wouldn't have gone into that temple if I knew the mountain was capable of. I try to stop you. You could have mentioned your demon doppelganger was on the loose. Come on, Theo. You know how crazy that sounds. I didn't even believe it myself. Yeah, yeah. I understand. Next time, just talk to me, though. I promise I'll believe you. Okay. Aww. Why is it so easy for you to trust me? Seriously, you barely know me. Honestly, you remind me of my sister. That's adorable. What's she like? Oh, you'd love her. Actually, you might not get along at first, but you'd eventually love her. She's a literal rock star. She's a musician? That's so cool. Okay, she's not literally a rock star. Alex is just amazing at everything. She's studying to be a civil rights, civil rights lawyer. Wow. How do I remind you of her? You both live so deep inside your own heads. Oh. <laughs> Alex has this amazing internal compass. It's obviously... It's... Oh, Jesus lordy. It's obvious that she'll get where she needs to be. I can see that in you too. I wish I could say the same for myself. Uh, let's do that one. Your sister sounds great. Do I really remind you of her? Are you kidding me? You're the one who's dead set on climbing this mountain, and you don't even know why. That's classic Alex. I'm just teasing you. Why are you climbing this mountain anyways? You're right, I don't even know why. I just had to get out of my head. I'm stuck in a cycle. You're preaching to the choir here. I've had many a soul-destroying day job. Work is fine, actually. I just... I'm going crazy. I can't stop thinking about dumb crap that doesn't matter. <laughs> Every night, dude. <laughs> Every night. 
my brain fixates on these stupid things that happened forever ago. That's, dude, that's everyone. I should be over them. None of it even matters. I'm good at keeping up appearances, but the truth is, I'm barely holding it together. I'm sorry, that's some pretty rough stuff. Can I help? You're already helping. It feels good to say it out loud. You don't talk about it? You don't talk to anyone about it? No, not really. My mom knows I get depressed and have panic attacks. That's about it. Aww. No wonder you feel trapped. How do you cope with anything? I drink mostly. Alrighty. And get mad at people on the internet. Hey, that's like, oh my lord, this is way too many options. Um, oh, like, yeah, I would ask, if it was me, I would ask why you're up on the mountain. How about you? What brought you to the mountain? I'm just kind of bumming around, as usual. I started this new job in Seattle. I thought I finally knew what I was supposed to be doing with my life, but I hated it. So I quit after a week and hopped the bus onto Canada. I just felt this urge to get lost in the middle of nowhere. Now that I'm saying out loud, I realize how flaky that sounds. <laughs> it just sounds like you're under a lot of pressure. Not really. Everyone is so patient with me, though I guess I'm putting a lot of pressure on myself. People always think I'm comparing myself to Alex, but I swear that isn't the problem. I'm just worried I'll never figure out where I'm going. Dude, that's some deep shit, man. You said you wanted to feel lost. Maybe you should just embrace that for now. Maybe. Who do you think built the temple? It looks ancient. It must predate everything else on the mountain. The resort, the ruins, the city. There's a lot of history here. Yeah. This mountain has met so many things to so many people. I'm starting to understand why that crazy old lady lives here. You ran into her too? What's her deal? I think she's just a mean person. But she does seem pretty content living out here. Oh, that was the wrong accent. Would you mind talking about what depression is like? It sucks. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but what does it feel like? It doesn't feel like anything. Alex struggles with it too. I really want to understand. We can talk about something else if you want. It's like I'm at the bottom of the ocean and I can't see in any direction. It's claustrophobic yet I feel exposed. I remember feeling normal, but now it just feels out of reach no matter what I try. Then again, I was probably always messed up. It just took some hurtful thing to bring it out. There must be something wrong with me. Whatever happened, I'm sure it's not your fault. I guess I thought I could, I don't know. I'm just floating in abyss, swimming in random directions, hoping that I find something. That's really why I'm here. But I can't escape myself. I'm literally fighting myself the entire way. Maybe this is all pointless. Madeline, you just saved my life. That's not pointless. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. <laughs> oh. Look, you're a good person. You're a little intense, but you're a good person. I think you're trying to push out. you trying to... Wait, what? I think you're just trying to push out of that rut you're stuck in. And that's a total legit reason to climb the mountain. Maybe. That's helpful. <laughs> this part of you isn't haunting you. Maybe she comes with the territory. Do you think I'm stuck with her forever? Well, she's stuck with you too. That's not helpful. Do you want to destroy this part of you? So you want to destroy this part of you? Won't that hurt you too? 
If I don't think she's going to keep bullying me. Bullying me? She says she's protecting me, but that's obviously not true. Maybe she thinks she, oh, maybe she thinks she is. She could be some kind of twisted defense mechanism. Honestly, who cares? She has so much control over me. I hate it. Maybe you can learn to control her instead. The feather helps a lot. Thanks for teaching me that. Just one of my grandpa's many nuggets of wisdom. Are you close to your grandpa? Yeah, I was. Aw. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. That's just how it is. All I can do now is stay positive and live a meaningful life because that's what he would want. Yeah. I'm so sorry, Theo. Thanks. What else did you learn from your grandpa? So much stuff. Actually, he was the one that told me about Celeste Mountain. He always said that this place changed his life. After I quit my job in Seattle, I realized how close I was to it. I felt like something was telling me to come here, or he was telling me to come here. Grandpa said that the mountain was special. Do you think he went through the temple like us? Do you think he understood the power of the mountain? He never talked about what happened here. I doubt your grandpa was as messed up as me. His experience was probably less violent. <laughs> he fell in the mountain before I was born. I don't know what he was like before that. I wonder what he learned about himself here. Thank you, Theo, for believing me back. Believing in me back there, I mean. Believing in you was the easy part. I wish I could have helped. I was pretty useless stuck in that thing. You actually helped a lot. Honestly, I couldn't have made it without your support. So cheesy. <laughs> oh, why not take a vacation instead? Why not take a vacation instead? What do you mean? Dude, you needed a change so you came to climb a mountain? Why not do something relaxing instead? Go to Hawaii or take a bath. I guess I feel like I need to accomplish something. Oh wait, wrong one. I guess I feel like I need to accomplish something. It sounds like you have enough on your plate already. I guess it is kind of extreme, but that's how I am. I need something to challenge me. And I can't just do something a little bit. It's all of me or nothing. I want to remember this night. Whoa, slow down, girl. You know what? I want to remember this night. Let's take a selfie. I thought you'd never ask. <laughs> Aww. God, this art style is so cool. Oh my god, I wish someone taught me to draw when I was little. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh. I made my eyes tear up a little bit there. You know, despite everything, I oh, despite everything, I feel pretty good right now. Wait a second. You're going to reach the summit tomorrow. Don't jinx it. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm ready to put this all behind me. I'll be cheering you on. We should get some sleep. Oh. Our good night, Theo. Hello, forgot the voices. Thanks for being cool. What can I say? It comes naturally. I Theo is just too too suave for me, dude. <laughs> and then we have another dream sequence that can be shown with the uh, the fire. Uh, we get introduced to a new mechanic. Uh, the golden feather, which I can't do with the keyboard, so I have to use the controller. Um, so you go left and right. You can dash out of it, as I will demonstrate here, to cancel it. But they don't last very long. I don't know how much seconds they are. One, two, three, three seconds? And then they come in these bubbles, which you have to dash through uh, to actually use the power up. They'll kind of push you back, and I think... Uh, if you run out of dash and bounce on them, they give you your dash back. I don't know if that's like useful tech technically, uh, but it's something that exists. 
I see my boy Artismo has decided to play Celeste as well. The Northern Lights is so beautiful. How, how did I how did I do the voice? Yeah, they are. Where are we? We need to talk. Okay. I finally understand who you are. You're not my true reflection. I'm not. You're everything I need to leave behind. You're cruel, paranoid, controlling. Why would you say that? No, it's okay. I understand now. I don't need you anymore. So you're just abandoning me? I'm setting you free. We'll be both so much happier. You're you're so 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 stupid. Ooh. You think you can just leave me behind? You think you can blame everything on me? You think you're above me? Ooh. Answer me! Calm down, please! Calm down! Breathe, Madeline. Use the feather. I don't think uh, Dark Madeline's gonna like this very much. <laughs> Oh shit, okay. Oh yeah, it doesn't work for, for... You think the, <laughs> you're going to think about a feather to stop me? No, my feather! You're not above me. You can't climb this mountain. It's time to accept that. <laughs> Madeline, what's going on? <laughs> Madeline, what's happening? Oh, oh, that's a really cute little sprite thing. Not a sprite. That little chibi drawing is really cute. Oh, sure, but when I jump on a spike, I freaking implode. How? Oh, shit, dude. Could you imagine you're back after that? Damn, girl, shit. When are you going to stop falling? Oh, that's a, that's, that's a little nice touch. The reflection's on the rock. So I don't think there are any strawberries here in this um, in this section of the game. I, I think it's because they wanted to focus a little bit more on the, on the story aspect. Uh, and then we get introduced to this uh, block here who is at rest, but if you dash into him, he attacks and then does stuff. Uh, I don't exactly remember uh, a whole lot about this level. Don't kill me. Is there anything on the left here? I should use the joystick. <clears throat> I'm afraid to go down there. So, like what I said before, uh, I don't actually have a lot of practice in this level. Uh, just because. Okay, we gotta use the joystick. Uh, uh, I, I didn't really have a lot of time this week, and uh, I had to get this recording out. Not that I didn't want to record, but uh, you know how it goes. <laughs> You just run out of time and suddenly you find yourself recording another episode for your YouTube channel. <laughs> um, so my week's been pretty crazy. Uh, it's because I have an online class and uh, a lot of in-person classes that have just been uh, insane. I don't know why I did that. Um, I watched High Noon for a class where we talked about like Matthew and and, and and stuff like that. Uh, super really good movie. I killed myself because I'm on a joystick and I hate it. <laughs> this is the worst part for me because I have no control of directional inputs with a joystick. I think I can still do this. No, I can't. Uh, with a joystick. It's very hard for me to do diagonals and it sucks that I have to do this every time. Uh, but we got it. Uh, how do we activate this man? Okay, well I found it. Hey, can you? Thank you. Go up now, please. Uh, I do know where the tape is here in this level. It's actually right here. 
uh, as soon as we activate uh, Mr. Rubble Rob Block over here. Thank you. I will be back. And this song is dope. I'm gonna be quiet just so you can hear it. Holy moly, brothers. I mean, a big fat bowl of dongs today. <laughs> Come on, get on the side. Go, 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 quick. I'm dead. I'm dead. No, I'm alive. Let's go. <laughs> Holy Jesus. Good to know. All right, that's kidding. Goodness gracious. I can't believe I have to do a side B without practice. This is going to be off. <laughs> Anywho, um, yeah, I watched High Noon and that movie's fantastic. Love that movie. I've never watched a Western in my life, so I don't think there's anything up here, actually. I do need that feather, though, so let's get down there for, for a quick second. Uh, what do I need that feather for? Oh, I was so close. It's over now. Why would she leave me alone? I hate her! She's part of me. I'll never be able to get rid of her. And she was right. I couldn't climb the mountain. Madeline, you just gotta believe in yourself, girl. I didn't even know that was there. I don't think this is the first time I ever see that, by the way. What is this taking me towards? Oh, I assume that way. Yeah, should have practiced this level. But that's alright, because, you know, we're just gonna go into the semi blind together. Please, Madeline, please! <laughs> Don't do this to me right now, girl. What is up there? I need to know. Oh, I guess this just lets you see the rest of what we're trying to deal with here. Am I supposed to get on top of this? Yes. I suppose so. I might have missed something, but you know, honestly, I don't even remember anymore. Oh no! Okay. Actually, did I miss anything over there? Oh well, I can't. I don't think I can actually make it back over there. I guess I'll find out where that heart is at the end of the chapter. Cause... Don't actually remember where it is. I'm gonna go down here. I think it doesn't matter where you go. Oh, now we get introduced to these things. Which, so remember how the bubbles kind of return your balance if you bounce off of them? This is the same thing, basically. They're just their own, like, uh, yeah. specific mechanic. I don't know if they have anything special to them, other than the fact that they're basically just bubbles, and then this is the safe room in which that they're in which they are introduced. Uh, but sometimes you want to hit them, sometimes you don't. It all depends on the situation. I guess they're both a hazard and a 
helpful thing. They're kind of honestly like the spring that push you up into the spikes 16% of the time. What the heck am I doing here? Okay, this is what the joystick is for. Sick. Is there a specific way to go here? I have no idea. I don't know, she might- I- I- uh, Isaac. Madly might just go into like a monologue at some point. Cause- cause of the last thing. I should be really looking for those giant stone tablets. I might have missed like a bunch of stuff already, but uh... Nope, nope. We, we're doing- we're doing keyboard for this. Okay. <laughs> as much as I don't like you uh... BS in me, Madeline, right now is not the best time to do that. I'm gonna go topside. See if there's anything different. Is there like a difference? Oh my. Okay. Why do you do this to me, game? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Got the climb! Oh my! <laughs> Obliterate you! Obliterate masses. Is there anything down here? Well, uh... I guess I find out right now, and I'm dead. Okay, so, what you're supposed to do... Is do that, I guess. Okay, now we're back to keyboard for this. Okay, well, I kind of forgot how to do that. Nice suit. Hello, Mr. Bird. How are you? Hey, this is old lady's back. Hey, what's up, girl? Oh, hello again. Of course you're here. Calling it quits, I see. No, I fell. It's over. That's, that's probably for the best. The mountain doesn't pull any punches. Yeah, I get it. I wasn't strong enough to climb your stupid mountain. You can laugh at me again if you want. <laughs> I did actually, I didn't mean actually laugh. Some messed up shit, dude. Sometimes you got to know what to throw in the towel. You'll get over it. You know what? I had a lot of time to think about climbing out of this cave, and I'm already over it. That part of me was right. I can't actually do this. Just go home and be sad, miserable forever. You, <laughs> you clearly aren't over it. Over the, over the mountain. That's the point of the game. Shut up, I know. I don't want to give up. But no matter how hard I try, she sabotages me every step of the way. A lot of kids come here to climb this mountain only to give up. It's a shame that you fell. I was starting to think you'd make it. What makes me so special? I, I've never met someone so angry at themselves. Honestly, I thought you'd climb the summit just to spite yourself. Gee, thanks. This girl you're talking about, it sounds like she's holding you back. Talk to her. Figure out why she's so scared. You think she's scared? I guess I've never thought of it that way. Yeah, you were being an asshole earlier. Like, be free! It's like, I don't want to go, I'm scared! <laughs> Stop wasting both of our time and ask her. Oh, wrong voice. What have you? What have you? What was it? What have you got to lose? She's right. What do? What do you have to lose, Madeline? I don't know how to find her. She's she's part of you, right? If you look for her, it won't like, take long to find her. So you know about the mountain's power? 
Of course I know, I live here. I tried to warn you. You need to work on your messaging. A glimpse at truth is good for people. Even if most can't accept what they see. There's no shame in turning back to your car driving away. Someday you'll be ready, then you'll come back. No, I'm going to see this through. No more running. I thought so. Good luck. <laughs> Can I actually get up here? I don't know how to do it with the controller anymore. <gasps> what poggers? You can actually get up here. You can't do anything, but you can get up. You can get up there. Oh wait, no, she has more to say. Old lady, what did what did you want to say? How can you stand living here? Isn't it hard to deal with this all the time? It's true, you never really get used to it, but it keeps me sharp. I like that about it. But the mountain is so confrontational. Sure, it doesn't beat around the bush. Celeste Mountain is a place of healing, dear. The first step of healing is confronting the problem. It's never easy. Tell me about it. No, I, old lady, I love you. Like, <laughs> say more stupid shit so I can... Oh shit, okay. <laughs> uh, I got I got baited and I smarted by this uh, thing that's running away from me. Come back here! Let me love you! Is this gonna kill me? I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna assume it's gonna kill me at some point. <laughs> Come back and let me love you! Oh, uh, so there's like you can actually just go through it normally and go to the side there, but you can uh, fall through these little holes and there's one right there, but uh, I've never been able to actually get through that hole. So I'm not going to do that because there's actually a hole here that's much easier to do. Uh, I was actually surprised that it took that my first try. Uh, and there's spikes here so you don't want to dash into them because I dashed into them like... Okay, so I have practiced. I practiced one time and then I was like, okay. Uh, I can do this part of the level. There's no way I won't die a million times. Oh, God, I always think those things are part of the background. But they're like so like phosphorescently pink that I- Oh no! Uh, they're so like pink that they somehow don't register in my brain as uh, an item that will kill me. Damn it. Dude, are you, you gonna chill out? He's like, I'm gonna go back to napping. Okay, we're at a new part of the level. Hello. Uh, do you wanna do you wanna talk now? Looking for me? I thought you were done with me. That was a mistake. I'm sorry. You think you have it all figured out? You think you don't need me? I said I'm sorry. We need to move past this. You expect me to trust you? You aren't innocent here either. But I know you're scared. Look, we're at rock bottom. There's no point in fighting. I can keep digging. I could pull us both down to the center of the earth. What would be the point? Let's climb out of here. Oh, shit. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that was sick. Let's climb out of here together. Come close to me and I'll make you regret it. Oh yeah? <laughs> okay, do over. I want to do over. I want to do over again. What? You're not supposed to dodge me? There we go. Oh, don't kill me. Whew. Just had a flashback right there. Nope, no laser speed. No laser speed. Oh, okay. Maybe you can get some more out. Oh my, oh my, oh my god. Okay, well. <laughs> you can get some lasers off. But not today, homegirl. You're getting all this, oh my, getting all this love. Let me love you! <laughs> Let me love myself!
<laughs> it's just like <laughs> Madeline's like give me kiss. <laughs> I can't with this girl. Oh what? It's just my pinky toe. You think you can escape? <laughs> Why are you running? Oh my god. Okay, that's not what I meant. <laughs> Why are you running? Okay, maybe you can run. But you can't! Okay. <laughs> you can run, but you can't hide forever! Okay, maybe you can run forever. You know what I should do is just... There you go. Ooh. Oh no! Keyboard! Dude! 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 <laughs> you cannot run away from me forever! There you go. I will catch up to you eventually, girl. Whoop. I'm dead. <laughs> uh, I'm like the, the I'm a firing my laser blast is too strong for, for dear old Madeline. Trapped in the eternal game of cat and mouse, me and you will be stuck here for all eternity. <laughs> Jesus. Just like face planted into those spikes here. Nope. No laser beams. No, 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 no! Oh. What's up, girl? We got love for sale. Oh my... I'm dead. <laughs> okay, we still got love for sale. 390... 395. 395 an ounce! Okay. You can ride for my love forever! Let's go! Bloop. Okay, you know what, though? Like... We eventually gain this power ourselves, but we never get the laser beam powers, and I'm just like, uh, where are my laser beam powers? That'd be sick. I did you a favor. You aren't a mountain climber. I'm just trying to help you. Let me love you! None of this would have happened if you had listened to me. No, 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 no! Oh my god! Yeah, no, 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 you can't beat me at this game. Oh, <laughs> just stepped off the edge. Madeline, you must let the love permeate your body. <laughs> Feel it course within your veins. Let the love fill your body. Oh my god. I'm. I'm gonna jump right into it. Let the love permeate your essence. Your very being strikes now! Oh shit, okay. Okay. Can we get a cycle that won't kill me? No? Okay. Okay. There you go. Uh. I mean, I guess that's fine. Just drop into. No, 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 no! Oh my God! Keyboard. Whew. What up, girl? Oh my God! <laughs> oh my goodness! Dude, if there was a modding community, or if there was like, if you could make mods for this game, there would be like a sick part where you'd go down like an extended one of these always and just dodge a bunch of lasers. That would be sick. Why can't I, like, why is this laser at this weird timing? I'm, oh my god, I'm not dead. I thought I was dead, but I'm not dead. Quick! 
Can you you probably make it back? I'm gonna go check. Oh, uh, you can. Now then, you don't gotta run away from me. I'm just here to give you a big old hug. Fine. You win. I guess you don't need me after all. If you want me to go away, I'll try. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> that's not what I want. I need your help now more than ever. Please, let's work together. Work together? You're joking, right? It's okay to be scared. Oh, you know, like in the Pokemon movie, when that starts disintegrating away. <laughs> and with we seven hearts combined. Okay, so now this is probably, uh, I think the last upgrade, like ability upgrade in the game. So it gives you ability to double dash, which is going to become fairly important later in this chapter. Or not this chapter, but... Uh, later when we have to do the seasides and stuff. Uh, so I think this is where you... I, I totally missed the wherever the cassette is, so we're gonna have to come back in this level. Um, but just seeing the petals and stuff, uh, really nice aesthetic. I'm glad it's here. Um, I was watching a Zero Punctuation review, uh, not about this game. I don't think he's ever gonna make a review of this game. He just thinks it's pretty meh. And, uh, I, you know, people have their own opinions, and and that's fine. Oh, I guess I guess that's an, uh, technically an ability, but we'll talk about that later. Um, and he doesn't really he just finds the game meh. How did we do that? If we can climb like that, maybe we can still reach the summit. You still want to climb the mountain? Why would you go back up there? <laughs> It's good to see you two playing nice. Hey, thanks for talking sense into me earlier. Don't mention it. I'm glad I can still be useful every now and again. Ma Madeline! Or I can't, I can't scream with that. <laughs> with that voice. Madeline, you're okay. I ran down to help, but it looks like you're doing fine. Thanks, Theo. Honestly, maybe that falls when I need it. Is this the part of you that you were talking about? She's like an adorable goth, Madeline. Big titty goth GF. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> you were right, Theo. I shouldn't be afraid of her. If her and I work together, I think we can still finish this. That's so rad. Wait, no. I didn't agree to this. You said we'd talk about things first. You're right. I understand that you're scared, but we both know that there's something we want to do. We have to at least try one last time. <laughs> oh, whoever wrote this character needs a Nobel Prize in awesomeness. Jesus. Yeah, you got this. I don't know. We were so close and uh, we uh, fell. The mountain. <laughs> <laughs> you pushed us down, girl! <laughs> the mountain tore us apart. Yeah, that happened. <laughs> but I have to believe we can put that behind us. I have to believe you're capable of this. That's not a bad idea. It'd still be difficult, mind you. But I'm amazed you got as far as you did butting heads like you were. I reckon you can make it if you cooperate. Okay, I'll try. Can I help? You've already done so much for me. Let me hold your bag at least. Good idea. This won't take long. Oh shit, oh my god. <laughs> I was badass. <laughs> That 
that old lady reminds me of the zombies from from uh Pots vs. Zombies and it's great. And also hi bird. Oh my goodness. So, I'm not going to do the B-side this episode because this episode's already 50 minutes long. We're going to go try to find that heart because I don't know where it is. Uh, I'll just cut the video until I find it. So, I'll be I'll be right back. <laughs> uh So, what ended up happening? Oh, this is so weird. The recording is happening while I'm saying it, so I can't speak without having this weird uh, disruption. Uh, but I'm gonna do my best to talk through this. So, the heart is in the same location as the cassette. And I gotta take this, these headphones. This is getting ridiculous. Um, so, um, it's in the same location as the cassette where the tape was. Uh, but you gotta keep climbing this little wall here until you eventually get to uh, the, the the top of this mountain. And the reason I'm doing it recording over the the video itself because I lost the audio, um, and I didn't want to record again just because uh, yeah, no 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 other reason than just to just to clarify this. So if you remember back in chapter one, we learned a combo that we had to do to get a heart in the first level, and we're gonna have to do it again in this level. Uh, so the hint is that, uh, well, the crystal colors are the hint. And so what you're supposed to do is just dash in that order. And as you can see, uh, I had a lot of trouble with that the first time because uh, I was still using a controller and the controller is not necessarily the best at taking dash inputs. But here it is, it's, uh, I don't remember the order exactly, but I get it in the video, so, yeah. Actually, I might just read the Google post, uh, from this. So the first torch is, let's see, up, left, down, right, up, right, left, and then up, left. So then the second torch is up, right, down, left up left right and then up right and then the third torch is uh down left up right down right left down left and then finally the the game has that little part splotched out but if you use a little bit of detective reasoning you would just say that everything is inversed because reasons. <laughs> I guess it's because they m might not have been able to be like come up with a with a with a symbol that would uh, you know correctly explain this. Uh, so they did this anyways. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, but in case I didn't say, it's down right, up left, down left, right, and then down right. Or it's backwards. I don't know. Um, so now what we have to do, and this is, this is something that I did in the video just to, uh, because my little, uh, performance in this chapter was horribly awful. I decided to do this at level again with less suckage, but as you will soon find out, I sucked as much dongs as I did the first time I did it. I could super dash there. I don't want to, do I really want to theory craft that? I could probably do that but there's no reason to do that because you would never come into this room in a speed run unless you were doing 100% which I would never be able to do <laughs> there's just much more complicated movement with that anywho that's the end of the video we find out we found out where side B was uh, I hope you're having a wonderful day and uh, um, I love you and uh, bye